No, thanks for coming yeah. on and um, such short notice and you know Worked talking. Out. Yeah, you never know when the time is going to be just right. Right. But um, I mean, you've made a a major splash in Omaha, in particular with Verley, yeah. which Verley the name. A lot of people are like, well, what, what's, what's Verley? What does Verley even stand for? Yeah, so Verley is just a playoff of the, uh, the word virtual reality. Where do you see Verley, I mean, as far as from where it's at right now and where where it's going? Because it's helping realtors with listings to help sell them, sell that home faster, correct? Right. So a, a big misconception is that we actually help agents sell homes, and that's not what we do. We help agents sell themselves. So we are technically their technology partner so that they can, you know, leverage the technologies we have to win more listings and help sell mm. sell more houses when, you know, and get those listings. Sure. So, no, that makes sense. Yeah. So they're getting more eyeballs. Right. So, they're, so when they go to listing presentations, they have more to offer than just saying, hey, I'm going to do still photos for you or, hey, I'm going to throw your house in the MLS because, you know, Zillow has really made the MLS a lot more irrelevant because now anyone can list their home on Zillow and it has essentially become an MLS for, you know, for sale by owners. Mm. So we're trying to combat that by giving these technologies to agents so that they can actually, you know, have that leverage to keep those commission prices um, where they're at without, you know, sure being asked to, hey, I want 2% commission. Yeah. It's like, you know, I'm sure they've all had to deal with that. Oh, yeah, because, I mean, margin compression is an issue in a lot of fields, Huge. especially in real estate. So, okay, so that that's resonating with me. So somebody, FISBO, for sale by owner. Right is able to use a platform like Zillow because Zillow is now marking themselves as the main platform. Correct, yeah, so that's where they have all the eyeballs, all the searches, so everybody's going, you know, that's most people's first stop is Zillow. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if I'm a for sale by owner and you come to me as an agent, you say, hey, I want 7% of this listing, I'm gonna put you on the MLS and I'm gonna take still photos for you. You know, home buyers are saying, and what else are we doing? Like, this, this isn't, making sense to me for that 7%. And mm -hmm. obviously, you know, as agents, we understand that, you know, that's, there's a lot more that you offer beyond that. But right. from the consumer side, that's what they look at. You know, it's, they're looking at it just on the face value and saying, hey, you know, for 7%, I want more. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're giving agents, you know, more of that leverage to combat those, sure. those questions. And the word that's coming to mind to me is value. Right. I mean, you're providing that extra layer of value to the realtor, separating themselves from the market. Correct. Marketplace. Yep. Right. Yep. So they get the technology, they, they get content, and and they get leverage over, you know, for FISBOs, essentially. So what do, what do realtors love most about Burley that are actively using it? Yeah. So I think one of the biggest features that agents like is their ability to take the content of the 3D tours, the drones, the photos, and then use those on social media to drive traffic to them and help them win more listings. Mm. So they can actually, you know, we, we create the content and we help them actually build the social media campaign so that they're actually putting that, you know, listing in front of, you know, buyers and future sellers. Mm -hmm. So that they're actually leveraging, you know, what they've just purchased and it's not, and they can monetize it. Gotcha. Yeah, technology is powerful if you're using it properly. Right. And I, I think too, campaigns, um, the word is, is sexy. I mean, people want to have yes. the campaigns going, but they don't know how to take it step by step to right. the marketplace. Yep. And that was kind of, you know, one of the biggest obstacles we faced at first was helping agents really take, take these, you you know, essentially just URLs and these links and help them monetize it. You know, how do, how do I take a simple link and a URL and, and put it out there where people can actually find it? So mm -hmm. building those campaigns were a big part of the value add that Burley was able to partner with agents on. Nice. So for, you know, any realtors watching this that are not using Verly, yeah. haven't been able to leverage themselves um, with the tool that you're offering, what would your message be to them? I mean, because it seems to me that they're they're definitely missing out on a tool that's going to, um, you know, be extremely impactful in their ability to sell that home. Right. Yeah. So, I mean, the biggest value that we can provide to an agent is, you know, a differentiate, differentiator in what you can provide to a consumer, you know, to someone who's listen, getting ready to list their house. Mm -hmm. So we want to make sure that you win that listing, first of all, and then that you are able to show 
what you do differently in the market. So, mm -hmm. I mean, if the, the biggest value to them is that they're getting, you know, they're getting drone photos, 3D tours, marketing campaigns, and then we're actually helping them leverage that against, you know, the right buyers. Gotcha. So it's all encompassing. It's all encompassing, right. And it's showing somebody who's on the fence of maybe putting the house on the market by themselves versus getting an agent that is using Verly and has these tools in their back pocket is going to only allow them to make more money on their house. We've seen that like 80% of buyers start their search online. So mm -hmm. they want to see these things when they're, when they're going to Zillow and listings and, and they're going to start to differentiate how, you know, what an actual virtual tour is and then just a, a video tour. Mm -hmm. So yeah, eight out of 10 people going online, the days of, not to say that people aren't looking at a billboard or a, you know, a booth or whatnot, but people are on their phones. Yeah, so you have to build a billboard that's on their, their mobile device. Yeah. Essentially, that's what, you know, videos are. So this is a, an, an easy, cost-affordable way to, you know, create rich video, rich content that's going to capture attention and then put that content in front, in front of the right audience. Yeah, so. you nailed it right there. I mean, that's the thing, too. I mean, the shotgun approach. And that's the value of social media is that you can put your content in front of the people that, that need to see at the right time. Mm -hmm. And, you know, with Facebook and Google pulling analytics and data where they, they are the first one to know when somebody's getting ready to move. Before I tell my parents, before I tell my sister, my brother, my neighbor, <laughs> Google and Facebook already know I'm getting ready to move. They Based know I've been looking at houses. And what you've been clicking on. Right. Based on your search results. I mean, it's simple data mining. That's why those services are free yeah. because they then leverage that information to run ads and put them in front of marketers, which, you know, provides a lot of value to marketers and, you know, businesses because you can then run your ad for pennies on the dollar to the right person. Mm -hmm. Data is king. Data is king, right. I remember when Mark Zuckerberg was um, in court and they're like, well, Mark, how are you making money? I, know, I saw that. <laughs> like, I, mean, I, I literally laughed uh, out loud. Advertisements? Was, they were like, well, how can you provide a free platform? And he's like, ads. <laughs> like, you're, you're, missing, you're missing the main concept. Oh, yeah, man. That was, that was perfect. I mean, Zillow's now in the mortgage space. They are, I mean, they're, they're looking to be that one-stop shop for, for all vehicles. Right. And with the amount of traffic they do have on Zillow, they're in a very powerful position, Definitely. which is kind of scary. It is. A uh, lot is out of, you know, the, the hands of the actual agency more. And, they, and Zillow's, you know, made a lot of interesting plays to take over a lot of those yeah, territories. it's kind of like an Amazon of, of real estate. Right. So if you don't have the data, the technology right. with the data, you're going to be left behind. Exactly. It's a, they're, they're trying to change the game. Yeah. And, and they're doing fairly well at it. Yeah. So. so is that where you feel like Verly is, I mean, you're in direct, compar you're in direct competition then with a Zillow. Right. I mean, we've, we've picked to partner on the agent side because we think in the long run agents aren't going to go anywhere they're going to they're going to be here for the long haul people are still going to find value in having an agent partner so that's why we you know essentially have a partner with agents as well mm -hmm. why do you, why do you think agents will um, continue I, to flourish yeah I, I think that human factor um that that you know that trust that's been established is always going to be there with an agent mm -hmm. so i i think the way that agents may be perform and do things will obviously change over time as it are, you know, always has. Um, but I think agents aren't going to go anywhere. I think people will value that relationship mm -hmm. over just the transaction. Yeah, so. I completely agree with you. I mean, robots do not have emotion. As I say, even in the mortgage space, mortgage is 90% emotion, 10% math, because people are constantly making emotional decisions mm -hmm. and they're providing rationale on the back end based on what they feel is right and wrong. Yep. And as a trusted, you know, agent, you know, that, that trust and that guidance is huge. For sure. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's the biggest factor is establishing that trust. And I think that that'll, that'll never go away because, because it is such a core value, you know, to who we are as people. So, yep. yeah. What's the best way to, to get in touch with you? Yeah, so I, um, all of our bookings done online. So if you just go to getburly.com, you can book online. Um, you can also call our office, and someone will be happy to help you. Perfect. Sounds so, good. Thank Thanks you. Appreciate again. it. Coming on. Yeah. Thank yeah. You.